What is up guys, I'm Julius and today I'll be teaching you how to create this split smooth slide transition. So I am here in my Premiere where I've prepared two unedited clips where I will showcase the transition and how you can create it. So the first thing I'm going to do is go to the middle of my clips by holding a shift and pressing the down arrow like so. And I will drag this clip up here. Then I will hold down shift and I will go should we say um, 26 frames to the left? One, two, three, four, five, then one. I go five frames at a time by holding down shift and then pressing the left arrow key and one frame just by pressing the left arrow key. And what I will do now is drag this clip over here. Very nice. Let me just zoom a little bit in on the timeline so you can see what's going on. All right, nice. Next, I'm going to go into my video effects and then transform. And then there will be this effect called crop and you want to apply that to the effect that you are transitioning into so just apply that and basically what this one does is we'll just crop your video but what we want to do here is crop from the bottom so we get it into three bars let's put this one at 66 percent that's nice and now i'm going to hold down alt and just duplicate this clip like so very nice and let's maybe do this one bottom 33%. Let's just hide our first clip so we can see what we're doing. And then from the top, we're actually going to go down a little bit. Also 33%. That is nice. So let's just unhide this. Beautiful. Let's do this again. And now we just want to have a clip for this bottom bar here. So let me just hide these so I can see what I'm doing. So this one should be zero at bottom and 66 from top. That's beautiful. Very nice. All right, now I'm going over to my effects again. And I will go into Distort and look for an effect called Transform and just apply that to my clip. Very nice. Basically, what we do want to do now is keyframe it, the position. Basically, this Transform access this video, but it's an effect, so you can save it as a preset. But basically, we want to key it from the left. So it is. 960 in the x-axis and then our sequence is 1920 so it will be negative 1960 like so next up i will just press here use composition shutter angle toggle that off and change it to 300 something crazy here that looks nice next up i'm going to copy my transform and just paste it onto our other clips like so and then let's start keyframing i'm going into position enabling keyframes I will go forward 16 frames. So hold line shift and press right three times. One, two, three, then once. And then I will return the position so it comes back in. And I will do the same for this other one, but I'm going to start five frames later. So I go five frames from where it starts, enable keyframes, and then 16 again. One, two, three, 16, return to position. And I do the same thing for this last one here. 10 frames later, then 1, 2, 3, 15, 16. That's beautiful. This one, let's just move this one one frame. Nice. Right, so basically what we have now is this thing. This does not look incredibly smooth, but you can see the, 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 the shutter angle doing some work. That is why it's blurry. And we have this offset on the animation, but I want to make this smooth. So I will select both my keyframes here. Right click, ease in. Right click, ease out, and I will do the same for the other ones. Ease in, ease out, ease in, and ease out. The reason why I decided to make this transition 16 frames long is because then we can go to the middle by going five frames to the right, and then one, two, three, and now we're at the right. And in my top one here, my top video, I will open this keyframe here, just drag them a little bit so it speeds up during the middle like so just a little bit that's beautiful I'm doing the same thing for the other ones it's beautiful this is the last one all right take a look But anyways, that was all I had for this tutorial. I hope you enjoyed watching and learned something new. If you did, 
consider subscribing, dropping a like, and maybe even a comment. But anyways, see you guys. Bye bye.